want to say that uh, so much of my happiness has been in him, but I have been happy ever since we've been married. And uh, my happiness is not in people or any human being. My happiness is in Christ. And I accepted Christ when I was very young. And even before I met him, I relied on Christ as my Savior. And he kept me when I was in school. And he enabled me to learn my lessons. It was the ability that he gave me to help me through school. And then he helped me when I went to work. I worked three years as a missionary work in the United Presbyterian Church. And uh, he was with me all the time there. And I was considered one of the best teachers they had in the county. And then when I married, well, I was blessed above all because I, th I feel that God gave me a good husband. And I have been, I dedicated myself to uh, being a wife after I married. I didn't work but part of three years, and that was to help financially. It wasn't my wish to teach. But after the children began to grow, I gave it up. And I dedicated my life to them and to people around me. And I have been happy through the sickness, and we never were people of any money. But we were happy poor. And nobody can tell me that you can't be happy poor if you trust in the master because he will take care of you and he provides. And that's what he's done for us. And I know none other than the hand of God that has kept us as we have been. And I have had a happy life all the way through. And not because of money or houses or land, but because I felt he loved me and I knew I loved him. And I have been willing to give up anything for his happiness and for his place. I didn't seek to seek my own happiness, but his as the children. And I have been happy in all that I have, don't know any other life I would want it to live other than the life that I have. And I don't want it any steps backward but forward. And I hope and pray that all of you will be as happy the rest of your lives as I have been, because there is no happiness without Christ as I see it. But with him, all things are possible. And I love you. There's nothing that you can do to make me ever not love you. And there's nothing that he can do to make me not love him. Now, for whoever else can do what they want about that love, my love is overflowing. And my life now is the happiest part of my life since I have known life. Because I have all of you all, and you seem to love me. And I know I love you and my husband. And I love God above all you know because he's my source. And I thank you very much for your attention. Aww.